So I saw this UPS driver and I was like, you know what, let me just check and see. And look at that, got my package. BC racing coilovers for the uh, E53, so that saves me some good time because I was I'm literally about to take an hour drive right now to go check something, so I wouldn't have even been home for this delivery. Look how things work, and I was at my lucky number, pump seven. <laughs> That's funny. Thursday, so that's good. Took two days to deliver because they shipped Monday and then they delivered today. Well, in the clip, you guys will see how. Well, in the clip before this, you guys saw how I ended up getting them. So, yeah. Let's check inside, see the contents. And there was a bit of a discount because the box had some damage on them. So I got them from Coilover Depot, shout out to them. They shipped literally same day, like within a couple hours of me purchasing them because I told them I needed them Thursday, Thursday but Friday the latest. So they sent lanyard, some sticker, well not a lanyard, um, what is those things called? Key ring or keychain and some stickers. Cool. And then BCs, they have some stickers, of course. Uh, see, BC Racing Rear Integrated, Rear Integrated, this is the warranty information. So, boom, I'll put this aside as well. Actually, let me put these in here so the wind doesn't blow them away. So let's come check and see. Hopefully you guys can hear it. So they're nicely secured. Nice. Oh wow, these are actually lighter than I remember. The ones that I had before from the last one were actually heavy, but this one isn't. So boom, this is a rear and integrated rear so it's a true um, coil over in the rear so it's not like a spring perch and then or a coil spring and a strut whatever it's called it is a true rear coil over which is one thing that's good because it it makes the ride quality better better in a sportier sense i don't believe it's in a comfortability sense is a front boom and they are already pre-loaded from factory and it has the camber adjustments and everything at the top uh, so this is a front right so boom nice coil over high performance shock absorber nice so you guys can see good BC quality funny because at one point I did say that I would never pay full price for a set of BCs, but I got these for less than retail, so I still did it. Um, go back in. Something like that. Good. Uh, let's check the other two. Just because Boom, this is the other front, the front left. These may have been a display pair. So, there's like some dust on them. Here. The last one, boom. And I didn't show you guys an up close one of the front. I believe it's 12k front 8k rear something like that um regardless that doesn't matter because in the 
not the near future, but over the winter time, I'm gonna be converting these to bags. So I'm going to be taking these springs off, putting an airbag conversion on this and running airlift management because I love bag vehicles. I love bag SUVs especially. So that's what I'm going to be doing. So as you guys can see, so the BC coilovers, I'm gonna put these in the X5 because I'll be driving it tomorrow in my boy's shop. So I'm gonna sit these here for now. And actually give me a second because I have another part. these called sway bar and link something like that um, I'm pretty sure the ones on these this car is done for so luckily they had them at two auto zones that are not too too far from where I was or not too too far from here so I was able to go pick them up so that's gonna be that um, yeah anytime I do BC coilovers or coilovers of anything I always get end links if they don't come with them because uh, they have to get disconnected for the most part anyway and two um, For the most part people don't do them unless they modded the suspension So it's just a wear item that you've taken care of um, another thing Speaking of stability that I'm going to do for this vehicle Hopefully I do remember to put screenshots of these parts actually. Yeah screenshots of these parts I'm not gonna put the brand or anything Because um, I don't do free promotion. So I'm going to be getting a brace kit for this um, SUV so it has a front strut brace a lower um, strut brace a rear middle strut brace and uh, a front mid strut brace no 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 so start over front strut brace lower front strut brace rear mid strut brace and a diff brace so the whole car is going to be a lot stiffer like what i want from this thing is to ride really sporty and not have too much body roll or anything like that because it's a big heavy suv so i want it to be as solid as possible um also in the future i'm going to be doing all the um bushings and everything like that for the same reason i want this thing to drive nice like it was brand new or better than when it did when it was brand new because uh, we did have an X5 in the family. My uncle had one a long time ago. Same uncle who also had an E36 that was tight and silver. But um, yeah, I just remember how great that car rode in like back then. Like it was just like the sport SUV thing was like a new concept. So driving in an SUV that spelt, that spelt, that felt like a sports car is just, it was crazy. But yeah, thanks for watching, like, comment, and subscribe. That was a um, BC coilover unboxing video, and I showed you guys a couple extra parts that I'm going to be putting on. So yeah, like, comment, and subscribe. And you already know, like I say every other time, drink water, motherfuckers.